Hey guys, it's iApple Tech, and today I'm going to show you how to upgrade your MacBook Pro's RAM. Uh, this MacBook Pro is the late 2011 model, and it comes with 4 gig, and we are upgrading it to 8 gigabyte with crucial memory, pretty good memory. Now, the things you will need are your, of course, your new memory, and a Phillips number zero zero screwdriver. I picked this up at Ace for a pack about like ten dollars or so. So make sure you make sure you do have this. So the first step is to go ahead and remove these screws right here. There are four at the top, two right here, two right here, and two at the bottom with a total of ten in all. So let's get down to it and open these up. Now these four screws in the back near the top, and when I mean the back, I mean where you have the design in Apple California text up here. Wow, that's all I focus. There you go. So this right here, these four screws in the back will be longer than the screws in the front here. So make sure you have those separate from the other ones. You can see the difference right here. That is the longer screw. Now you should have three long screws and seven small screws. The top left over here does, does not have a long screw. It does have a short screw for some reason. So then once you remove all the screws, go ahead and lift up the bottom plate of your of your Mac be gentle with it you may have to give a little force here it should come off just like that and that will reveal the inside of your Mac now the RAM is located right here with two slots each right now has the two gig for a total of four and we're gonna go ahead and take our 8 gigabyte 4 and 4 and replace it with the 4 gigabyte. So to remove the RAM that we have already installed you'll see two little flaps here. You want to go ahead and pull apart and the RAM should lift up. Just go ahead and slide that out at that angle. Taking, taking notice of the longer side is on the left and the shorter side is on the right. Then go ahead and do the same for the bottom ram. That should lift up like so. Then go ahead and pull that out as well. Might be a little difficult. Just go ahead and grab that. Just like that. And now we're ready to install the other ram. So then once you have your first ram in, just go ahead and press down. Make sure it is secured in there just like that and then go ahead and take your second RAM and go ahead and insert that as well and then once you have your second RAM in just go ahead and press that down like so try not to ram it in there <laughs> and then once that's done you can go ahead and take your lid and go ahead and put it back on carefully So then go ahead and replace all the screws back into the original spots. Make sure you do get those three long screws right back here in the back. And then you can go ahead and turn your computer back on and we'll go ahead and show you the geek benches for the new 8 gig of RAM. So then once you go ahead and turn on your Mac, go ahead on the Apple logo and click about this Mac and go over to the memory tab and you should be able to see that you have installed the 8 gig 
the 4 gig on the bottom slot and the 4 gig on the top spot and let's go ahead and show you a Geekbench okay so this is the Geekbench with the 8 gig and the numbers are way off it's less than with the 4 gig but I think I just have to use the memory uh, for a little while and hopefully that number will go up so do not take this number seriously I've used the 8 gig with Final Cut Pro and Photoshop and the internet all up and they are super fast so like I said before, don't really take those numbers too seriously because the 8 gig for your Mac uh, runs all your applications extremely fast. So if you guys do like this video, don't forget to give it a like up. Leave your comments in the comment section below and don't forget to subscribe to stay updated. Thanks guys.